The troubles being experienced in Venezuela were earlier feared to have effects on Guyana, with many citing the possibility of huge numbers of Venezuelans seeking refuge in Guyanese soil. These fears have been quelled, but there are now reports and sightings of Venezuelans in Guyana purchasing medical supplies. When contacted on whether this will have any negative effect, Minister Norton told Headline News via telephone he was unaware of the issue, but doubts these purchases will affect us. I have not heard anything about it, but what I know for a fact is that uh, you know, we have an open bid system, bidding system, competitive bidding, and we have um, companies that are bidding that are not Guyanese companies. So literally we have a wide range from which we can choose from. So I doubt whether that will affect us. Minister Norton said they have already awarded contracts for the rest of the year, so any possibility of large-scale purchasing is being ruled out. Asked about the possibility of small-scale purchasing of these supplies from local pharmacies, Dr. Norton posited the following. Then that, that becomes a legal issue, okay? And um, we might have to look at that at a, at a different level. The health minister stated that there is no need for action unless the health system is being affected. If that becomes the case, however, then his ministry will play a very minimal role in addressing the issue since it will be out of the ministry's purview. Uh, unless, it's affecting, if unless it's affecting our health system only, then I would have a problem. I mean, if they are apart from that, it might be one of, of, um, of finance and um, legal affairs. Rihanna Minister Norton said systems are in place that will prevent any such large or small-scale purchasing of the medical supplies in Guyana. As such, he relayed confidence that Guyana's health system or supply of medicine will in no way be affected adversely by such a move. Good. That's it.